Hi guys, it's Lucy and welcome back to another video. Today I'm just going to do a quick video just to show you a couple of bits that I've bought to start back on placement. Um, these are just little things that I've picked up along the way that might be useful second time round. Um, those that don't know, I'm going into my sec I'm in my second year, so I'm going into second year replacement and just thought I'd do things slightly different this year compared to my first lot of placement. So yeah, I've only bought a few little bits, but yeah, let's get straight on with the video. So the first thing I bought was from Amazon and it is one of these um, Tiger stationery tough boxes. Um, I've seen a couple of students here and there use these. Um, basically we have um, portfolios that we have to get signed throughout the placement period and mine got absolutely wrecked last year. It was in my bag. It's got the indentation of it from my helmet um, and then my water bottle leaked all over my bag, all over the ambulance and yeah it got a bit wet so I thought this year would do slightly differently and try and protect the portfolio. Um, I would just get a normal wallet but the portfolio this year is a lot thicker so I thought I'm hoping it fits. I haven't tested it yet because I'm at home and my portfolio portfolio is that uni but it's fine. Uh, yeah this was, um, I want to say £2.80 possibly, something like that. I'm not doing this in any particular order to be honest. The next thing I have is some Purell hand sanitizer, um, the pump one. Um, basically the ambulance service do provide you with hand sanitizer on the ambulances, um, even ones that clip on your waist. It just doesn't deal with my hands very well and it just fe it feels very chalky, like I just don't like the texture of it so I prefer to get my own. Um, I have in the past. I've been buying these little ones and there is a retractable clip that goes around this which goes on my belt. Um, however this is a lot exp more expensive way of doing it um, um, and then with it basically I've been using a Medtree carabiner the whole time I've been on placement and I know I can trust their carabiners that I don't lose stuff, they're good quality. However mine is starting to wear out so I got in touch with the company and said do they still send them out? Um, and they don't however they looked around their um, stock room and managed to find one for me so I sent it with my order um, so it's just one of these it's the most simplest carabiner it hasn't got some faffy screw on it it's not double ended anything like that most basic thing but I know I can trust it which is why I wanted one of them again from the same place this we can get them from the ambulance station um, but I just thought while I was ordering another item I'd just buy it and then I'll when this runs out I'll get one from this hub. Um, but yeah I needed a new pen torch. The one I have is a bright white light and I wouldn't want that shining in my eyes if I'm feeling ill so yeah I wanted the warm light instead and this is a lot brighter actually. Um, so hopefully I actually might get some better pupil reactions <laughs> and it's also got pupil gauge on it. Uh, but yeah then I also got I get it out. My current fob watch has run out of battery and I do plan on getting the battery changed, it's just having time to get it done. Um, I don't know, you can't do it yourself, I don't think. There's no like, screws, I don't I don't know. I'm not technical in that sense. So I've just bought a new fob watch for now. Um it's just a black carabiner one. I did uh, originally buy one of these and it arrived in the post shattered and um, the whole of the glass was broken. I think this is Oh wait, it might be plastic, I don't know actually. Yeah, but the one I bought was plastic and it just completely shattered. Couldn't use it, the hands had all fallen off and everything. Um, so I sent that back and just never got around to buying a new one. Um, but yeah, I'd much prefer the carabiner on it. Basically, we um, as students have polo shirts which don't have any sort of belt loops or anywhere to hook um, one of these on. Um, you could have a pin one, but because it's a polo shirt, the pin drags it down. And it's much lighter material than a shirt would be. Um, so mine has always been on my belt loop, but it's a right faff being a pin to get that off and take someone's rest break. And um, because you need it kind of higher up to look at the patient and look at the um, fob watch. So I'm hoping with an easier attachment, we might get better rest breaks as well. And it also came with a spare battery, which is handy. Not a clue how you'd put a new battery in this, to be honest with you. But you know. Then um, my lunchbox, I've used it an entire year and it's just gone. I bought a yellow one from Asda and although it's distinctive, you can tell it's mine, no one else has a yellow lunchbox. It's just kind of gone a bit 
scratched, a bit worn out. So I bought a new lunch box. However, I was buying some protein powder and they also sold lunch boxes at my protein. So I thought I'd try it out. They had a deal on, I think it's cost me about 150 or something. Um, and it's just got some movable um, dividers in it as well. So I don't know if this is going to be good or not. Um, it could be an absolute waste of time. And I don't know if it's very big, to be honest with you. I don't know what I'm actually going to fit in it. Um, but we'll soon see. It feels good quality. Uh, there's one decent clip on it. Then the final things I've bought, and these are kind of personal items rather than placement, but I do need a new one ready for placement anyway, is a card holder. So I've got two, um, red and blue, but I use the, I've got one and it's, it's worn out basically. Basically it clips and you can put all your cards in and I've just found this much easier than having like a massive purse and it just slots in your pockets better, especially on placement. So I've bought a new one, it wasn't planned for placement, but I've got a new one for placement now. So yeah, so that is everything I've bought for placement. Um, there's a couple of little bits, like I wouldn't usually go and buy new stuff, however, I just decided this year just to buy stuff and invest in it and hopefully it lasts. That might give you a couple of ideas for what's taking place, I don't know, but um, I will see you in a video very, very soon. Bye guys.